Hello friends, hope you are doing good. So today's video topic is how to upgrade Windows 7 to Windows 10 and in this process all your personal data, all your files will remain safe and all the softwares you have in your Windows 7 operating system will also remain safe. So as you can see I have some files and folder on my desktop and I also have another partition. This is my second partition and also have some files and folder in it. So all the personal files in your desktop will remain safe in your uh, other partition will remain safe and all the softwares you have I will show you the software I have I have few softwares in my system I will show the softwares so as you can see I have a few softwares but all the softwares you have in your system will remain safe in this process so let's start open your browser and then type Windows 10 press enter and then click on the Microsoft official website now you will see this window scroll down and here this is the option we need create Windows 10 installation media click on this option download tool now so this will download media creation tool this is the software now open the download folder so this is the software we need media creation tool now right click on it then click on properties and if this software is blocked simply click on unblock option click on apply then click on ok after that again right click on it then click on run as administrator click on yes now you have to wait for a few seconds if you see this kind of error uh, as you can see this is the error of media creation tool so if you see this kind of error message and you can see the error code as well to fix this issue you have to simply open the Microsoft official website there is an article I will show you first cut this window and this is the article of Microsoft and in this article as you can read these are the two protocols which are by default disabled in Windows 10 so you have to enable these two protocols by downloading Microsoft easy fix software so scroll down and you will see the option of easy fix click on it this is a software easy fix click on this option and this software is available on a Microsoft official website click on here and you can see the download has been done now Microsoft easy fix open the download folder this is a software double click on it to run the software I agree next that's it installation completed click on close and I will put the article link in the description box now move on to the topic now run the media creation tool again right click on it then click on run as administrator click on yes you have to wait for 10 to 15 seconds and you can see the error has been resolved media creation tool is now working fine click on accept and here you can see you have two options upgrade this PC now or create installation media or you can also download Windows 10 ISO image from this option so for now we are going to upgrade this PC now click on this option then click on next and the downloading process has been started and it will take around 15 to 20 minutes so I will fast forward this video now click on accept and after that wait for a few more minutes this will take some more time now you can see install Windows 10 keep personal files and apps so this option is important make sure this option is selected otherwise if there is something else you can change it by clicking on this option change what to keep and there are three options keep personal files and app and the second option is keep person files only and the third option is nothing so go for the first one first option keep person files and app then click on next recheck both the option then click on install and this process will take around half an hour so I will fast forward this video so guys installation has been done now and you can see my desktop data still remains safe so there is no data loss I will show you the other partition I have so this is my second partition 
and you can see all the files and folders are remain safe so there is no data loss at all i will show you the software i have so as you can see the software is still remain safe so as i told you that in this process all the data you have in your system will remain safe and there will be no data loss there will be no software loss in this process i will show you the system properties as well and here you can see windows 10 pro so this is how you can upgrade windows 7 to windows 10 without losing anything this is all for the video thank you